Plant-based and flavorful are two ways to describe this next spot. It's time for Food to Go, and joining us with all the details are Supervisor Christina Chajuri and General Manager Alyssa Tsutsumi of Alo Cafe Hawaii. Aloha, ladies. Thanks for joining us this Aloha. morning. Aloha. Good, good morning. Good morning. Thank you. Just to start us off, tell us about the concept behind Alo Cafe. So for the for Alo Cafe, for the concept, um, it started with Meiko and Rio. They started their first location in Waikiki in 2021, and they wanted to provide the community with healthier options, but more fun options. So not just like your standard menu, but they wanted to be more creative with it, mm -hmm. with a variety of locally sourced ingredients like fruits and veggies and try to get everyone a bit more healthier. Yeah, too. Mm -hmm. wonderful spread. Tell us about some of your popular items that we've got on the table. So colorful, like you said, healthy, but also flavorful. Uh, we have a couple original recipes here. Um, our firecracker tantan ramen is our newest um, item on the menu. We also have a very popular plant-based um, coconut curry. So all original recipes farm to table and we utilize local businesses and local farms as well. That's amazing. We've also got some, one of my favorites, avocado toast maybe, if I'm guessing correctly. Mm -hmm. That one looks so good. And then we've also got some breakfast burritos. Tell us about some of the other dishes we've got here. We've got quite a few, so again, mm -hmm. wonderful spread. Yeah, so um, for, for this one right here, this is our plant-based Hawaiian roll. So we use a local spinach green wrap mm -hmm. to make it a little bit healthier. And then we make our own spread. So it's like a hummus avocado spread with some fresh kale, fresh tomatoes, fresh greens. And then we have our kale blueberry salad, which is really good. And uh, we make the, all the sauce and all the dressing from scratch as well. That looks amazing. Mm -hmm. Now, for someone who maybe leans more towards the sweeter side, like me, even during our summer months, we need something to kind of cool us off. You have some colorful dishes here and some acai bowls. Tell us about some of the acai bowls viewers can expect. Yeah, so um, we, what we really like, one of our bowls is our lily koi bowl, just mm -hmm. because not many places offer something like that. And uh, the beauty about the bowls is that we make all the bases from scratch, actually in-house too. Mm -hmm trying to use as many local ingredients as possible. And even with our peanut butter, we do make the peanut butter in-house as well, which is nice. Mm. So if you want something kind of like salty, savory, it's a good option as well. Really nice. I love when you can add something, like an extra thing to the acai bowl, so it's not just straight fruits. Exactly. Really mm -hmm. cool. Now, what are some smoothies that they can get at the at Alo Cafe as well? Yeah, so for the smoothies, uh, I would say these are probably our top three best-selling smoothies. They All, all the smoothies sell pretty well, mm -hmm. but this is our Waikiki Bliss. It's papaya. Uh, banana, pineapple, and uh, strawberries. Okay. And the good thing about our smoothies is that we use fresh pineapple juice for all the bases, mm -hmm. apart, unless you want like a plant-based milk one option as well. So we don't use any like powder or any ice or anything. Everything is like just all fruit and fresh pineapple juice too, which is great. Great to know. And mm -hmm. locally sourced too, like you were mm -hmm. saying. Great grab-and-go items that you have. Now we all love good specials, maybe some good discounts. Any specials at Alo Cafe? Yes, so for our Alo Cafe at Our Soul at Kaka'ako, um, we have a happy hour that just started. Okay. Um, it's going to be from 8 a.m. to 10 a.m. So that's going to be for our Kamaina to come enjoy um, if they want to come in for brunch, just to have like a little discount when they come and eat. Um, and then we're also future hopefully opening for um, dinner time as well. Um, so that's still up and coming. We'll have more information on that like hopefully shortly soon. Great to know because I did see some of like the ramen style dishes. That's great for lunch and dinner time. Mm -hmm. Now, just to close off for today, ladies, where can we find you guys in person and online to kind of follow the journey, see any updates that you've got? Yeah, so for um, so right now we have three locations, which we're really happy about. So like I said, we first started in Waikiki and then the second one opened in Bishop downtown Honolulu. And then the third location is at uh, Salt at our Kaka'ako right now, which is uh, the main location for the full Full menus, full kitchen as well. Prime spot. Mm -hmm. We love that. What were your hours of operation? Have we talked about that one yet? I don't think so quite yet. Hours of operation? Yeah, so um, our hours of operation are going to be daily um, from 8 a.m. to 2 p.m. Um, and we're located on the ground floor against Oahe, right across the street from One Love Church. Great to know. So there are multiple locations. We did have your Instagram on the screen so that viewers can find you on Instagram and then online as well to keep up to date. Thank you, ladies, for joining yeah, us this thank morning. Thank you so for having us. Thank yeah. you for